right, so here's that ProFlow. So basically, this is your home page. Got a couple options on here. You'll have your setup. Basically, you'll do that whenever you first get the truck and your engine setup. Advanced tuning, pairing settings, gauge, ECU, and diagnostic. We're not going to touch the setup wizard because it's already set up. Here's some tuning that, we, that I talked to you about a little bit. Um, air fuel ratios, you can adjust your idle, your cruise acceleration. If you have boost, you can just literally just adjust them on the fly like that. Um, oh crap. A couple other things. Advanced tuning, acceleration, you get a little pump shot basically. You're doing some crazy stuff. Fan controls, decide when you want your fans to turn on. Fuel modifiers to get that um, fuel trim set up. All mine are zero right now. Your idle tuning, you can change basically what you want it to idle at, RPM wise. Let you know your idle air control percentage. Cold start enrichment, none. But you can add some if you need to. This you'll do has like the whole walkthrough on how they want you to do your base timing on this, but you don't got to do this after your initial startup. Crank fuel on off, so you can turn off some of the stuff. Your idle control, your cell phone, close up. Your fuel sump, if you have the system that you can buy additionally with this system. Your limiters, your rev limit, and then your boost cut for rent over boosting the engine. Don't have boost, so that's not a problem. Got your spark control, idle advance, total, total spark, and then you got your vacuum advance. Your self-learn settings, you can just decide how fast you want it to learn and all that stuff. I don't really mess with this, I've just left it on fast. You got a couple options, I usually roll around with this one over here to the side for me. You know, all my gauges work, but I still like having this one up. You could also run your, this display right here. You could also run this one right here, which just has a bunch of gauges, and then you can like change the uh, basically what you have. But pretty much everything you see here, you can find on this display. So that's why I like this one. And as far as other stuff, there's a diagnostic mode, which really doesn't do a whole lot. It kind of tells you if all your injectors are plugged in and firing. And then there is... That's pretty much it. You get some ECU stuff.